welcome you to our showcase event for the 2019 year. The Perspectives Lecture provides an opportunity for alumni and friends to get together, to connect, and to hear from an industry leader on their personal experience. Today's event support the Schulich Real Estate and Infrastructure Experience Fund. Thanks to our generous sponsors and supporters, we have raised over $18,000 tonight. These funds will go far in supporting the learning and extracurricular activities in the real estate and infrastructure programs. He would say he's really impressed <laughs> with, with the real property and or real estate and infrastructure group in terms of pulling together this amazing group of people, both alumni, industry partners, and students to come together to this event to hear Mitch Goolhart speak about his incredible journey. It's good to be back among York grads, York supporters, York staff and professors, and above all, York students, and of course, one of the biggest contributing factors to the ascent of York University is the Schulich School of Business, its reputation, and its alum. To everyone who has led that transformation and continues to lead it, congratulations on your vision. Vision. And what I mean by vision, as you will see, is not some lofty, far-off goal. In fact, what I've experienced and observed is that a vision to be achieved, certainly in business terms, must represent incremental change to the existing status quo. To find and strike the balance between having an entrepreneurial um, strain running through a company with institutional disciplines, to me, is the ultimate and I was an entrepreneur, you know, basically with no institutional disciplines. And Walmart, yeah, they were entrepreneurial with a lot of institutional um, disciplines because they went public many years before I met them. I remember when I first met Rob Walton, you know, we were together privately and I asked him, I said, how do you run a $64 billion company? He says, we don't. We just make each decision as it comes before us, one at a time, in the best interest of the company and the shareholders. And a $64 billion company that's run itself. Um, once again, thank you all. It's an amazing event to come here because it's grown so much, but yet it's still a fireside sort of chat opportunity to listen to industry icons, to listen to you, Mitch, tonight. And I want to thank you on behalf of all, just to be able to hear about your journey, but not just, you know, from the beginnings at the tennis club when you said, you know, with all these senior executives, they're people, underscore people. And to hear that journey and how you got to where you are, and then bring it back to the sharing of McFlurry. It's truly inspirational, uh, and it's an opportunity to support not just something for the students, the alumni, the industry as a whole. And so, Marks, we're fortunate to have such a strong and close knit Schulich community with friends and leaders such as Mitch and other keynotes who have come before him supporting our industry and the future leaders in real estate and infrastructure. So, on behalf of the Perspectives Committee, the SRPEA, thank you for all attending tonight's lecture.